Sexual harassment in the workplace is not something new. I remember my mother telling me a story about what happened to her when she was working as a secretary in the 1940s. And her boss decided one day that he wanted to kiss her, and he proceeded to chase her around and around the desk trying to get a kiss. My mother was very upset, and all she could do was quit. Because there were no laws at that time to protect employees, but there are now. There's two types of sexual harassment. One is called quid pro quo, which literally means this for that. And it's when your boss or your supervisor requires you to give sexual favors in order to be promoted or to not get fired or other consequences. It's obviously against the law. The other type of sexual harassment is hostile work environment. And that's when someone, not necessarily a boss or a supervisor, could be anyone, does things to make you uncomfortable in the workplace. For example, making inappropriate comments about your body, your dress, asking you two personal questions, repeatedly asking you out when you've already told them no, trying to touch you, etc. Or perhaps there are people in the workplace that are making offensive jokes or comments, they're keeping naked pictures of women up on the wall and doing other things to just generally make you very uncomfortable and make the workplace hostile. There are laws in place to protect you. We have helped many women who have had to deal with sexual harassment in the workplace. Give us a call and we'll see if we can help you.